Hello and welcome. In this video, we'll see how to make the last part of the machine wise. There is a clamping plate. Plate. It is similar to the this third part that is the jaw grip. Only the dimensions vary and the whole distance varies. Uh, and let's start it. Click on new standard mm dot ipt. Okay. Start the sketch. First, I'm going to draw a rectangle. And now I'll add the dimensions. This is a square, so to be of same length and width. So 50 into 50. 50 into 50. And now I'll extrude it at a distance of 8 mm. And now we'll add the holes, two holes which are specified here. Using the hole command, I'll change the view. Since it is a countersink hole, and uh, we can do it. And the outer diameter is given as 12 mm. And the inside diameter is given as 6.3, angle is 90 mm. All the things are selected because we have done it before. And just going to mark the holes. And now we'll specify the dimension. Since it is symmetric, you can choose, uh, you can vary the distance. That is, you can change the distance like the from here. You can tilt it. Uh, so this one will be 25, center to center distances, 24. 25 and center to desk center distance is 24 so total length is 50 so from one edge of the clamping plate to the other uh, to the center of the hole it will be 50 minus 24 divided by 2 that is 13 Now for this hole, we'll make it 25 and this one is 13. Now the clamping plate has been made and now we'll apply the material. It is made of same material FE410W and I already created it in the library. Apply. 